Welcome back to Learn PHP on Code Academy. We're in the Intro to Built in PHP function section. This is generating random numbers. Generating random numbers may not seem obviously useful, but as your programs become increasingly complicated, you'll see this is actually a common task. For example, to randomize data for testing. The rand function returns a random integer. We have some flexibility with how we invoke it. Invoking rand with no arguments will return a number between 0 and the largest number our current environment will allow. This is a quirk of PHP. We can find out what this number is by invoking a different built-in function, get rand max. Here we have this variable max and it's assigned get rand max. We then echo max and then we echo rand, which is going to print the number between 0 and max. In the code above, we assign the largest possible random integer to the max variable by invoking the get rand max function. Next, we used echo to print a random integer. This integer will be a number between 0 and max. Functions often have a strict definition which dictates exactly which argument it expects to be called with and results in an error otherwise. The rand function, however, is somewhat flexible. If we'd like more control over the random number we generate, we can invoke the rand function with two integer arguments representing the smallest allowable random number and the largest allowable random number. Fun fact. The second argument provided can be larger than get rand max. These numbers are inclusive, meaning the arguments we pass in could be generated by the function. Here we have echo rand 1 and 2, print either 1 or 2, echo rand 5 or 10, print a number between 5 and 10, and echo rand 1 100, print a number between 1 and 100, all inclusive. Okay, let's get random. Use echo and get rand max to find out what the maximum random number is in this environment. Let's do that now. Let's run it. We do pass. 2 says, now that we know its bounds, let's see what we get when we invoke the rand function. Use echo to print an invocation of the rand function. It's totally optional, but you might consider adding this line of code between your other echo statements so you can read the output more easily. Let's do that now. Let's run this. We do pass. 3 says, OK, let's call rand again. This time use echo and rand to print a random number between 1 and 52, both inclusive. Let's do that now. Let's run it. We do pass and we get a number, 34, which is between 1 and 52. So what we're learning here is about generating random numbers. And we learn we're able to do that. We learn that get rand max is going to give us the largest number our current environment will allow. We then learn about rand, which will give us a random number between 0 and our max. We're able to use rand and pass in our own two arguments which specify our limits. As long as you're understanding that, you're getting generating random numbers, and I'll see you in the next one.